Yellowstone Steamboat Geyser erupts with terrifying force, leaving visitors stunned. Steamboat Geyser. The Steamboat Geyser. Steamboat Geyser. The eruption in the past six weeks. In a jaw-dropping display of nature's raw power, the Steamboat Geyser in Yellowstone National Park erupted today with unparalleled intensity, shocking visitors and leaving the surrounding area in disarray. Then this starts bubbling again and we'll go into a new eruptive cycle. So steamboats... Known as the world's tallest active geyser, Steamboat's latest outburst was nothing short of catastrophic, spewing boiling water and steam over 350 feet into the air and creating an ear-splitting roar that echoed for miles. The eruption caught hundreds of tourists off guard, many of whom were eagerly watching the geyser's routine bubbling and steaming. Without warning, the ground trembled violently, and a thunderous explosion of water and debris erupted skyward. It was like a bomb going off, said one witness, still visibly shaken. People screamed, children were crying, and everyone just ran. It was chaos. As the geyser continued its relentless assault, a misty veil of scalding steam enveloped the nearby boardwalks. Park rangers acted swiftly, corralling visitors to safer areas while shouting warnings to stay clear of the rapidly expanding danger zone. Reports indicate that at least a dozen people sustained minor injuries from the hot water and ashfall, though no life-threatening conditions were reported. And especially going back in time, lots and lots of data. Geologists at the U.S. Geological Survey, USGS, described the eruption as one of steamboats most powerful in recent history. Early data suggests the event may be linked to heightened seismic activity in the region, with over 50 minor earthquakes recorded near Yellowstone's Norris Geyser Basin in the past two weeks. These tremors are believed to have contributed to the intense buildup of geothermal pressure beneath the surface. This eruption is a stark reminder of Yellowstone's volatile and unpredictable nature, said Dr. Ellen Harper, a USGS volcanologist. While steamboat geysers eruptions are dramatic, they are a natural part of the park's geothermal activity. However, we are closely monitoring for any signs of escalating seismic or geothermal events. For those who witnessed the eruption, the experience was both terrifying and humbling. September of 2018, that's when that first feature out there formed. I've seen geysers erupt before, but this was like nothing I could have imagined, said another visitor. The sheer force of it, the sound, the heat, it's something I'll never forget. It's beautiful, but also terrifying. Teasing. <laughs> the aftermath of the eruption has left parts of the geyser basin blanketed in volcanic debris. Waterlogged trails, scorched vegetation, and steaming pools have prompted park officials to temporarily close the area. Cleanup crews and geologists are working to assess the extent of the damage and to determine whether further activity is likely. As Yellowstone's most iconic geyser settles back into silence, questions linger about what this eruption could mean for the park's delicate geothermal system. Could this be a precursor to more frequent or larger eruptions? For now, experts urge caution but reassure the public that such events, while dramatic, are part of Yellowstone's natural cycle.